It's one thing to come out to Egypt. But I think the real work begins when God has to take the Egypt out of us. Hello? Out to Egypt, save and sanctify and love the Lord. But a lot of Egypt still inside of them. And that's the process. That's the journey. And God says, the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to, I'm going to provide for them. They're not going to die. But unlike the culture of Egypt, which was unrestrained appetites, I am going to begin to put regiment of discipline into my people. I'm going to begin to give them a certain rate every day. A certain rate to me speaks of parameters. A certain rate means it's not unbridled. It's, it's contained within parameters. It sounds to me it sounds familiar or reminiscent where God says, here are the parameters. You can eat of every tree of the garden except for this one. We are a people that want to eat till our belly full. I don't, I want to say I don't understand, but I'm not sure if I'll be very, I'll be quite honest. Because Adam and Eve had a whole garden, every food to eat. Just this one parameter that God said you cannot have. But I think Proverbs talk about the sweetness of the forbidden fruit. Hello? <laughs> and here it is, God began within these people after he took them out of Egypt to begin to set parameters in their life. We want to eat till our belly busts. The flesh must know no parameters. But then read a, read a little further. And the people shall go out and gather a certain rate every day. Why God? Why? Why should they? Why they can't eat, eat, eat till their belly bus? And he says, that I may prove them whether they will walk in my law or no. You see, it is the parameters in the parameters that we are proven. If there are no parameters, we can't be proven. It's in the obedience that God proves us. We talk a lot. Prove me now, says the Lord. And God says, prove me, test me now. And we get excited. God can be trusted to be tested. But let me tell you, God tests us too. Big people do it. Hello? Hello? 